look at the snake whichever snake is winning you go with that snake it's not about being right in the market or being wrong in the market or the view of the market it's all about doing the right thing in the when they are covering make money when they are making money you listen to them and they are telling you to do the right thing and follow their footsteps and you see how far you're going to reach if you haven't grabbed the concept you are missing out big time because i know the value of the concept which i'm giving you is really worth its weight in gold hi everybody welcome to another very special video today you are going to learn one of the most powerful concept if you trade options there is no doubt about it you will realize that once you are trained in certain aspects trading becomes very easy you will also realize that relying on price action and doing the things which common trader do why do they fail and why it is so easy to sprint towards success into the markets so get ready to learn top shelf content as always oi snake theory oi stand for open interest trading profits like never before i'm going to give you the real life example i'm going to give you theory and most importantly in the end i have some vip advance points for you so get ready to learn everything about it knowledge which makes you money powerful concept of open interest when trading expiry let me tell you one thing very clearly trading expiry is 100% theta dependent now you know one year back two year back this concept was very popular everybody almost start to do algo trading you sell a 920 straddle and see how things perform for you but now you realize it that that's not really a smart way to go about it there are better ways we going to trade expiry like a total champion without doing an intraday straddle and without even knowing direction really is it even possible a lot of things are possible it's just that if you're not aware of it it's your responsibility if you think trading is a business you can get the best of for you and learn it sprint it to the next level which i'm going to come on on that important observation about oi build up and oi means open interest cover now suppose that today is expiry day for people who trade us market suppose it's zero dte right and now contract is going to expire today in the morning do you think option buyer will have any edge option buying can happen with 500 rupees even but option selling naked selling will cost a lot of money that means that people who sell in wholesale not retail they definitely are the more powerful people right because high money is at stake because suppose if you sell option for 5 rupees that option can become 100 there is a possibility so you got to be more careful wherein when you buy option the 5 rupee option can only become zero so you already know that your loss is limited this is a very important point open interest build up means when there is new contract in the market buyer meets a seller trade happened and then open interest go up whenever there are new buyers and new seller open interest bound to go up now when we look at option writing you can only win by looking at the option writer perspective his weaknesses and his strength this is a very powerful thing which we are going to use it completely like i say in my videos a lot we are not bulls of the market we are not bears of the market we are the real fox of the market who know how to make money in the market doesn't matter where market goes okay so this is important let's see this in action so layer by layer it will be super clear to you today was an expiry day in nifty being thursday right what do we see is that morning the morning first tick was 21605 where nifty opened this information is good enough for us now let's see what do we do with this now what you see on the screen is the nifty chart we realize it that nifty opened around 21600 this is good enough information for us so the candlesticks which you see is market index now what i did i loaded two strikes at the money why at the money because at the money the dk is the fastest clear now the red line which you see is a put a put strike open interest in the put strike and what do you see the green the green is the call the call open interest not the price open interest remember just few minutes back i told you the concept of open interest when the new sellers come into the market open interest go up that's what it means okay now majority of retail people do this 
really horrible mistake is that thinking where market is going to go. Let me tell you one thing very clearly. Nobody knows where market is going to go and market is full of traps. So there is no point in getting totally dependent on where the market is going or using indicators. That is not a smart thing to do. Now, what do we see? Let bulls and bear fight. What do I mean is that let the open interest of put and open interest of call, let them fight it out, right? There are people who are selling put options and there are people who are selling call options. Let them fight it out. You relax, take a step back. Anyways, we are retail, right? So there's not much of a thing we can do. We only have to see where the wind is and we got to follow it. Always better. So what do we see? We see that they are fighting it out, right? Forget about this brown line. It's not much of a relevance. Now, what do we see in around till 9.45? half an hour into the market, calls writer and put writer, they both are coming, they both are fighting it out. Nobody is losing and nobody is winning. Now, when we go ahead, what do we see is that around 10, 10.05, 10.06, what do we see is that call writer are going in the back foot. As you can see, the open interest on the call is reducing. That means people who are selling calls, they are a little scared that market is gonna go up. So they are covering their positions. Wherein the put writers are going really aggressively. Look at the aggression on the put side. That means they are selling puts left, right and center. So these are two snakes. They are both are fighting it out. Put is definitely winning. This much information is good enough for us because now the view is absolutely clear. What do we have to do? Make sure that there is no confusion around this point. This is really a dynamite of a point, okay? Now we know that the, we have to sell put in this particular situation. Now, what do we do? How do we exit? Now, I wanna take you to this 10.05, 10.10 10 approximately on the charts. Let's see what at the money charts were looking at around this time. And what would have happened if we would have followed this option snake theory? Let's find out. Here we are. Looking at the option chart, the chart of both the strikes, which I just explained to you, 21,600 call and 21,600 put. We are only interested to enter around 10.05, 10 a.m. approximately. So what do we see here? We see one thing that on the put side, if you see, it's 10.03, right? What do we see around 10? It was trading around 26, the put the winning snake which was put now this was really going down and probably we, we could have easily entered around 20 20 points roughly right if we are selling options now when we sell a put we see that it really has gone down and gone down and gone down and become zero that is a good thing but let's have a look at the call side as well if you look at the call side what do you see if someone is selling delta neutral strategy now in my opinion delta neutral is not a very smart way to go about it, right? Have you traded December? What did you learn from December? Market is telling you something, right? Going super bullish. Delta neutral is not 2010, guys, right? Now, what do you see here at 10 a.m.? What do you see in the call side, the losing snake? Immediately after the cover of open interest, immediately call shot up and call shot up really fast. So in other words, option which was trading around 32 became double in almost no time during the intraday itself which means if you would have sold call option right thinking that market's gonna be in range we're gonna get theta decay we would have lost heavily in this but using the theory which i just told you that has changed the game completely upside down on its head that is the how the trading needs to be done guys but now i have some more points to tell you if you haven't grabbed the concept, you are missing out big time because I know the value of the concept which I'm giving you. Really worth its weight in gold. But like I always say, you don't need to take half knowledge. You got to take it full. I'm going to tell you the exits, when to book profits, every single thing about it. And if you are a working person and if you really want to elevate your game, you see the WhatsApp number flashing on the screen. All you got to do is simply WhatsApp and ask for premium strategies, which you can do alongside your job or business. Or if you are a fund manager or you've been selling intraday options just randomly and you're managing big, big amount of fund, I've given you one logic. You can use this logic when you manage funds, right? And you will see why, because when you manage fund, you want to keep your risk small. Here, the risk is small. The reward is big. Theta decay is in your favor. You are at the right side of the market. What else do we want? Really good. Let's see what do we have next for you. Time for pro tricks. Now let's discuss about stop loss. Very important point. Now, as a thumb rule, if I'm selling something for suppose 20 rupees, 
it's my duty to keep stop loss at 40. The worst case situation. But in this theory, how do we do? Let me show you and it really will open your mind here. So now here we are. Around 10 a.m. we figured out that put is winning and then this put open interest, the red line you focus, it's going up, it's going up, it's going up. That means put writers are really aggressive and they are really building onto their position. That's what we know. Now around uh, 12, around uh, 12 it became stagnant and what do we see is that around uh, 2 p.m. Right, when around 2 p.m., 2.30, what do we see is around 3 p.m. open interest in the put. The winning side is start to go down. This means one thing that the put which we have sold for around 30 must be trading around one, two rupees. Now there is no point holding that put. So they must be squaring off their put and getting their margin free and going more towards at the money so that they can collect more premium. So as a rule of thumb, what one can do is if they are covering their positions, doesn't matter, they, are, they cover their position in two ways. Number one, if they are making money, as in this example, they are making, they made 95% of the position or profits already. So they are covering, you can cover with them. Or number two, they cover their positions when they are in loss. You see is that they were, they start to cover their call and call open interest, the green line which you see never gone up. They were not interested to short calls. So both the examples are here. So we got to just see what they are doing and just follow the footsteps, how easy it becomes. So the stop loss is the, the rule of thumb, keep the double, one is to one, always better, always easy, there is no problem. Number two point is that when they start to cover their position, remember there are two kinds of money in the market. One is retail money, and retail also two, two types. One are totally trained people, professionals, and second are untrained who get their life savings and they trade into the markets without proper knowledge. So they belong to 95% of the people who lose money in the market. Because learning, it's quite easy, but sitting at one place in this TikTok and YouTube shorts time, it gets difficult to achieve anything in life. One needs to be focused. Only when you focus, you achieve something, right? If this, if your focus attention is only for two, three seconds, very difficult to get anywhere. And here the picture is worth a thousand words. So open interest theory, stop loss. That's how you can do cover when they are covering, make money when they are making money. You listen to them and they are telling you to do the right thing and follow their footsteps. And you see how far you wanna reach. Now, my view about ELGO for working people. One of the favorite topics I wanna tell you about. Now, ELGO basically is what? ELGO is that you are working and you have, you know, uh, given your security key and you know, the ELGO is trading on your behalf. Sounds very fancy, am I right? But do you really calculate how much uh, brokerage you are paying, how much ELGO charges, taxes you are paying? If you make 100 rupees, at least 25 rupees is going into taxes, brokerage, etc. And plus, when you hit a drawdown, that's gonna be a double whammy for you. So not really a smart thing to do. Plus, ELGO has no logic. They just wanna capture theta, DK, just that's it. But when the logic which I told you, if you've been trading ELGO, and if you are an experienced trader, you must have got it. Today, we've got something really, really solid. So ELGO is not really smart. The best thing a working person can do is have passive income strategies, which are hedged which gives them very low level of stress and hardly any brokerage, very, very less taxes and much further better ROI, always better. So that is always the best thing. Now, how to book profits, people may ask. So before you ask, let me tell you, see, you sell something, why? You sell something because you, on intraday, that on intraday, it will become zero. That is your take, am I correct? That's what you want to achieve. So hold to the trades till the time Either your stock option, which you, the index option, I'm sorry, which you sold becomes zero or what you can do if the open interest start to unwind. I've told you the theory of unwinding open interest. Look at the snake, whichever snake is winning, you go with that snake. It's not about being right in the market or being wrong in the market or the view of the market. It's all about doing the right thing into the market. And doing the right thing, is it difficult? You please tell me. In just a matter of few minutes, you've learned something really special. Was it difficult to learn? Not at all, right? It's not difficult at all. That's the reason it and trial is for less smart people, right? You can elevate your trading game. You can learn the craft in record time. 
when you contact on this number you can get superior better strategies you can contact and get the proven model where i will pinpoint with extreme accuracy where you need to focus so that you get your results fast i'll give it to you straight no fluff no gas of any kind i do not dilute my content or the quality there is a certain work ethic which one has to follow you expect top shelf content and that's what you get less monitoring premium strategies is perfect for busy people this new years commit to yourself that you will give your 100% best shot in this trading business of yours which you are running alongside your job or business or if you are a full time trader right focus on making double the return what you made last year commit to yourself to do it and that's why starting of the year i've given you this method if you trade expiries and i know a lot of retail people are struggling to make money in traday this method is superior better methods make sure that you know the entry the exits the profit booking like i told you that's it for today guys i hope you really enjoyed the video make the most of it and like i always say you gonna do so well in trading you will surprise everyone i wish you all the best